Howdy folks, it's Meandering Mike in the Man Cave of Madness with my weekly channel update. As you can see here, it's a relatively busy week. I had last week's channel update. I've got a playthrough, almost four hours. This is the Battle of Pensacola. This is American Revolutionary War on the Western Frontier, Mississippi through uh, Florida. So obviously this last one was part of the Florida campaign. Uh, hard fought battle. Uh, if you wanna find out who won the last of the five uh, game series there. Check that out. And I have three unboxings here. One of them's an old one uh, from 2023 that I did when the game first came out, but it's one of the 2023 Charles S. Roberts Award nominees for Civil War game. So I updated that um, description, including the other nominees, and mentioned it is a Charles S. Roberts Award nominee. And so the two new ones that I did unboxings of are Gettysburg, yes, just titled Gettysburg. So to find it on Board Game Geek, you look up Gettysburg 2023. Um, this is from MMP, Multiman Publishing. It's in their uh, magazine, the Special Operations issue number 11. This is by designer uh, Scott Muldoon. Uh, so you can check that one out. And the uh, last but not least of the uh, nominees for the Civil War category is Grand Havoc Perryville from Revolution Games. This is Jeff Grossman design. It's uh, part of the, the Herman Lutman uh, series, The Blind Swords, but it's by a, a, a separate designer, uh, Jeff Grossman. So you can check that one out. That's the three nominees for the Charles S. Roberts Award. And then I have my video up there on further discussions on the Charles S. Roberts Award in general. Last week, we you know, mentioned all the different uh, period awards and looked at the Napoleonic nominees. This week is the Civil War nominees. We talked about the Mode Awards as opposed to the Period or Historical Era Awards. And uh, we're going to follow us up with at least another one or two uh, discussion videos on the Charles S. Roberts Awards. We'll talk about the Capstone Awards coming up. We'll do uh, uh, all the nominees for a mode award. We'll do an additional historical era period and we'll keep going as much as we can before the deadline on the voting for uh, the nominees. Uh, the voting closes May 13th, I believe it is. So that's all my content for this week. Uh, if you're watching Dan Pencali's Only Hero, I'm going to send him back to you. If you're watching on my channel, thank you for being a viewer and our subscriber. Take care and ciao.